Today marks the one-year anniversary since the beginning of the Israel-Hamas war. Despite the war being overseas, U.S. involvement has sparked Auburn students to speak on the subject. Eagle Eye's Sydney Babb reports live from Tumor Square. Yesterday evening, an Auburn Students for Palestine group came and held an art takeover here at Tumors Corner. After the demonstration turned violent, Auburn campus police and safety asked students to leave and facilities cleared away all of the chalk drawings. Tonight, they'll be back here for a memorial to hold in honor for all of the lives lost in the last year. Yesterday, a small group of students gathered for what they call an art takeover on Tumors Corner, doing chalk drawings and writing phrases in support of Palestine in the Israel-Hamas war. Things took a turn after an unnamed individual physically attacked protester Stephen McGentry before running away. Auburn University Facilities Management watch, washed the drawings and chalk away later on. All day today into the evening, campus security has been stationed at Tumors Corner. Students plan to return this evening to hold a memorial in remembrance of the lives lost since the war began one year ago today. Auburn campus security continues to have a presence here at Tumors Corner. We'll have more details to come. Sydney Babb, Eagle Eye TV, Auburn's News Leader.